Hi guys, welcome to my tutorial for frames and registering, um, not movement, but poses, I guess. Uh, I think in my last tutorial I mentioned opening up the models and I actually explained expressions. And this time, since I had a lot of trouble with frames and I still do sometimes. I thought that I should explain this. Um, actually, I'm going to open something that I'm still working on. Ren dancing the panda dance. Um, and because it's unfinished, I guess I can work on it to show you guys. Alright, so she starts here, and then if you notice this part right here, frame manipulation, um, you can move the frames like that, and since I already have something registered, I have her movement, um, but what we're gonna do is go from, first off, 245 is where I last stopped with the frames, and I'm gonna go to 255, zoom in, Select all and reset. Um, I'll rotate her arms like this. And here we are. I will register that like this with this button but I recommend that you select all first. Um, and then from that, she just, sort of like that, with frames. Not as complicated as I, as I thought it would be, but I might probably, I probably should explain it more. Uh, the thing that I like about Miku Miku Dance is that you don't have to, um, like in animation with drawings, draw every little detail. You just have a starting point and an end point and in the middle it just sort of moves. Also I'd recommend putting a good uh, distance of at least 10 to make it seem like you're not necessarily into that much. Uh, or they're not, uh, like they don't move too fast, unless you're doing expressions, because people do uh, change their expressions very fast, but, oh my, if I were to do that, like make her eyes open from 255 to 260, Register that, and then from 255 to 60, we're going to play that. That's odd. I haven't figured that out yet. Mm, that's really all I can say about frames. I'm probably going to explain movement next because that was really hard. But, yeah, that's it. 